We're out looking for chameleons. Uh, at night, chameleons go onto thin branches to sleep, uh, often to the ends of thin branches because that way, whilst they're sleeping, if a predator tries to crawl along the branch like a snake, uh, they can feel the vibration. Uh, and then they can just drop off to the ground uh, to try and avoid being caught. Ah, here's one. You little fella here. So this is a, a leaf chameleon. This particular chameleon, we're not sure if it's a, a new species. I suspect it, it may be, but it may, it may be just closely related to one uh, on mountains quite close to here. Uh, but it, uh, where you get uh, pygmy chameleons, they usually are very common. Uh, you can expect to catch four or five in a night when you're wandering around. Here's another chameleon. See here, sleeping bradypodium. Oh, not bradypodium, sorry, ramfolian. This is an adult male. You see by the large tail. There's a nice big male sleeping peacefully here. This uh, is a, uh, an, an island of evergreen uh, forest uh, in a sea of uh, savanna. Uh, and it means that this little, little fellow who really is adapted to closed canopy, wet, moist, evergreen forest, uh, is here on what effectively for him is an island. It's one of the, the reasons that these little forest living animals are, are often of conservation concern because a forest like this is, is really very unique in Africa, in this particular region particularly, uh, for so much of it uh, and being so intact.